Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, wherever you may be. Time for a couple of trailer reactions. So first on the docket, um, Dungeons and Dragons. Um, yeah, I, I'm not sure what to think going into this. Um, you know, there was, uh, again, D&D &D in itself, I mean, as a property, obviously there's been, you know, a massive resurgence due to things like Stranger Things, uh, which is great, Critical Role, um, you know, yeah, even The Legend of Vox Machina, in a sense, you know, kind of just, again, the, the fantasy uh, type thing. And, um, you know, as with so many things, Dungeons and Dragons, you know, there was that horrible movie adaption <laughs> a while back, uh, you know, from, from like game properties, be it video games or even like board game uh, type things, the translation hasn't been great. So let's see what Dungeons and Th Dragons Honor Among Thieves holds. Okay. Try this again. There we go. Here's the thing. We're a team of thieves. Okay. Okay, that should be better. <laughs> Forgot to plug in my uh, freaking microphone. And when you do this, you're bound to make enemies. Sometimes those enemies come looking for revenge. Truth be told, we help the wrong person steal the wrong thing. We didn't mean to unleash the greatest evil the world has ever known. But we're gonna fix it. So how do we pull that off? Uh... Figure it out over a drink? Probably best. You need to so give us a fighting chance. We're gonna need strength. You got this, right? I know you don't. We also need courage. Back to school. Magic. And you. What is that again? It's an owl there. Let's go! Be warned. There is evil here. I'm glad he's on our side. Wanna hold on to this one's dangerous. <laughs> but whatever happens. What is it exactly that you bring to this? I'm a planner. I make plans. You've already made the plan, so... If the existing plan fails, I make a new plan. So you make plans that fail? No. He also plays the loot. Not relevant. <laughs> okay. <laughs> March 2023. Okay, yeah. Um, that looks surprisingly good. Yes, there, there were a couple spots that looked a little cheesy, but it looked like so much fun. And um, <laughs> like I said, as I just mentioned, comma, comma, it's like I'm speaking voice text. <laughs> you do that so many times and it kind of comes to habit. Anyways, um, in a lot of ways, like I said, it, I, I as a recent example, 
uh, as I said again, Legend of Vox Machina, I get a lot of feels like from that, especially seeing the the type of character of uh, uh, I forgot what she's called, um, the girl with the red hair and the kind of horns type things. Um, uh, it, yeah, this it totally re re gives me more of a sense of that. I mean, again, a ragtag group of group of thieves, <laughs> you know, who who, who end up becoming the heroes. Um, yeah, it just looks like it looks like fun, <laughs> pure and simple. Uh, I mean, I'm not gonna try to pretend I'm deep in D and D lore or anything. I just kind of know the ba some of the basics, and, and you know, I've thought about you know, I've had some people I know who have. Uh, played D&D &D before, and I've thought about, like, hmm, it might be interesting, but I just never got to, to, to that level, but, you know, just as far as, like, the type of stories and lore that I do know that can come out of campaigns, and again, that has been tried to be made into uh, games like uh, it's Neverwinter Nights, um, not Neverwinter Nights, Neverwinter, <laughs> uh, which I played for a little bit and everything, which is based on Dungeons and Dragons and everything, you just get that feel. Uh, you know, kind of medieval, mystical, it, like I said, it just looks like fun. And again, you see, you know, I think I'm going to have to look at the IMD as, we do, uh, as we're doing it, because I mean, of course, you know, you see Chris Pine, you see Michelle Rodriguez, um, crap, I mean, the, there's a little girl there, a little mixed girl that I, I've seen her in a number of things, I just can't think of her name at the moment, let's see, IMDB, do do do. Dungeons and Dragons. But yeah, I mean, the the sets look good. I mean, of course, you know, I'm sure a lot of it is CGI. Um, yes, no, not the 2000s Dungeons and Dragons. That's not what I want. Uh, 2023, Among Thieves. Okay, there we go. Um, but yeah, I mean, the... The scenery looks amazing. The costumes look amazing. A as I said, it just looks like so much fun. Um, okay, so where we are. Du -du 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 -du. Production, 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 production. Du -du -du. So I'm saying, did I pass the actual cast? Uh, du -du 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 Excuse me, bear with me. Ah, here we go. Okay, so yeah. Uh, Michelle Rodriguez, Chris Pines, okay, the actor's name is uh, Sophia Lewis, um, Rajushin Page, okay, Justice Smith from, from Jurassic World, uh, Hugh Grant's in this, oh, okay, uh, David okay, so those are your big names, um, but, yeah, just, it looks like a cool cast. It looks like, you know, they're having fun with it. And, I mean, what do you really need from a trailer? I mean, again, that's the whole point, to get you, uh, a, a, as John Campia uh, and his crew says, is to get you, you know, excited, to get you, you know, all, all up in there. And so, and, and, I, and I, I'm sure I screwed the, I screwed the exact quote, but in essence, that would, that's what he and Robert Meyer Burnett say a lot. Uh, to like you know just really get you motivated to want to see this and that does that it looks so much fun so that's all I can really say about that as always feel free to share subscribe hopefully give me a like if you like my ramblings <laughs> uh, my, my videos tell me what do you think of Dungeons and Dragons Honor Among Thieves and yeah Feel free to leave a comment, let me know your thoughts, and as always, thanks for watching.